Excuse me, what are you doing here? Um, I'm here to occupy Portland. Um, you know, I've, I've been more or less occupying Portland my whole life, but uh, we're going to do this in a different way. Um, in that we are going to set up camp and we're going to build kitchens. Hopefully, uh, uh, we're going to uh, chant and make signs and make our voices heard um, to let the 1% know that the 99% is fed up with all of the bullshit and tyranny. And uh, we're going to peacefully, uh, if we must, um, change things for the better. You know, for everyone's good. Go. Um, I'm not really sure what to say, but we're here to uh, hopefully make a difference. And uh, we have uh, some people who really know what's up. These uh, veterans who have gone and you know served their their duty for their country, and they're out here, you know, trying to make make a difference. Uh, what I said to him was, a true revolutionary will stop at nothing, even hypocrisy, in uh, you know the pursuit of revolution. I see. And it's kind of impossible to not have some small level of hypocrisy in the things you do. I mean, here I am saying, you know, this is all for the, the 99% and all that kind of stuff. Um, but here I am wearing like corporate made things and smoking a cigar and being sort of a hypocrite. But, you know, I think it's better than not doing anything at all. So, you know, I, I, I'm not saying, I'm not saying, you know, just be complacent in hypocrisy, right. but sure some level of it is inevitable.